legs and hips and body, body. Let's get them, girls. <laughs> Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Okay, so before we get started, let's talk about the song that Monday bring on week. In honor of Pride Month, the best month of the year. All my queers, stand up. I am you, you are me. We are one. The song of the Mediterranean week is the woman loving woman anthem of the 21st century, bitch. Stand up for Honey by Kehlani. If you know, you know. That's all I gotta say. Let's carry on. <laughs> all right. So as you saw by the title of today's video, was that you already know what we better do today yeah we're gonna talk about my summer favorite basically the products that I'm using now that the weather is now hot warm sweaty juicy in my hair routine in my skincare routine and on my makeup yeah yeah we got three categories today we don't got just hair today no 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 anyways yeah let's let's Get this started. Oh, it happened again. Different angle, different hair, different makeup, different outfit. It's given ad time. Yup. Mm -hmm. I am so very happy to say once again that this video is sponsored by Skillshare. If you are living under a rock, I don't know, let me put you on to what Skillshare is, sis. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for anyone who loves learning and wants to explore their creativity and learn new skills. With an ad-free experience, new premium classes added each week, and subtitles in four different languages, the learning never stops. I've been looking for more aesthetically pleasing ways to present my apartment to you so I started watching this incredible series of classes by Lauren Cox called interior design basics there's like 11 different types of classes there depending on what is your vibe for interior design and I've been learning some new things that I need to start applying to my damn apartment immediately so I want to pass this gift on to you too babes if you are also ready to level up on your creativity your knowledge the first thousand people to join through the link in the description we'll get one month free trial of Skillshare yay thank you so much Skillshare now back to the video all right so of course I'm gonna start with hair because that's what we do on this channel and I'm gonna start with a product that has very recently come into my life and by very recently I mean literally like two weeks ago and it's already like up there as almost a holy grail fucking product and it's this one here this is the AG hair care recoil curl activator holy shit this is so fucking good and I cannot believe first of all that I have been sleeping on AG hair care as a brand overall did I even say that it was a cream it's a cream <laughs> it's a defining cream okay but is it a defining cream though like is it just that I feel like it's more than that the term curl activator suits it so perfectly because to me this feels like a one-and-done type of styler she's very much like a defining cream and like a soft to medium hold gel put in one girl it's hot when I wash my hair and I want to style it I want to do it as quickly as possible so when I can find products that perform like a two-in-one I'm gonna go for those I want to save my time I want to save my energy in order to survive the rest of the heat wave don't sleep on her that's all I'm saying next okay I've mentioned this one already before but I couldn't leave it out I couldn't leave it out of the pack because she's an icon she's a legend she's a star she's a hard-working woman she's a single mother of two this is a living proof full dry volume and texture spray I've already spoken about her it's an incredible fucking volumizing spray that gives me the craziest fucking root lift and she leaves a bit of texture lingering on the hair so like even after the day that I use it I I still feel that texture the next day and bitch I live I live I live for her I love her living proof you and me me and you I need 25 bottles of this please thank you next <laughs> okay this is a product that I have mentioned on my channel I think maybe once or twice but have I really spoken about her very well no so she deserves another mention yeah 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 this is the beautiful the wonderful the fluffy Amika plus size perfect body mousse I am on a mousse kick and I think it's because of how much body how much volume how much texture mousses give to my wavy hair and honestly for the swarmer time all year round but for the swarmer time baby i want big hair like 
for the one time a month that I'm gonna wear my hair down outside, I want it to be big. I mean big, big. I want it to be fluffy. I want people to see me and think, holy shit, what is living inside of her hair? And girl, I mean, no styler does that quite like mousses. And this one is a great option. I know I've mentioned like 7,000 different mousses on my channel already, but I just had to give her a big old shout out. Okay, the next following products that I'm gonna mention for hair are all from the same brand, and I apologize, babe. I'm gonna sound like I am kissing ass to this brand so bad. I just gotta tell ya. Let's take a minute to talk about Ceremonia, because if there is a hair brand that encapsulates the vibe and the smells of summertime is motherfucking ceremonia period fight me so yeah let's let's talk about this let's talk about this this is their ceremonia exfoliating shampoo treatment papaya scalp scrub it's just a good old-fashioned scalp scrubity dubity for when you need to clarify your scalp or you might just feel like mm, i'm just gonna pamper myself today what makes it so like interesting for me this is the texture it's kind of like as if you took a very rich moisturizing shampoo and then you whipped it so it becomes Comes this very like frothy creamy situation and then they added guava leaf and prickly pear cactus extracts which is like the scrubby part of this scrub oh my god it feels so luxurious i love using it at least once a week or once every two weeks because it's effective enough to actually get rid of buildup but gentle enough not to over dry or hurt my scalp okay second product from ceremony that we need to talk about we need to talk about we need to talk about it <laughs> It's their newest launch. We have a new member to the Guava Summer family. This is the Guava Beach Waves Salt Texture Spray. I live, I live for a texturizing spray, bitch. And this one smells like fucking guayaba. So I don't need to keep saying words. You just have to trust me that it's that good and that it's worth it, period. No, but seriously, seriously, this is such a beautiful salt texturizing spray. If you saw my previous video where I showed you my most recent like volume focused wash day, you'll remember that I used a finishing spray that gave me hold. So what I've been doing actually for the most part is instead of using a scrunch hold spray to finish off my wash day, this is what I've been using, but I couldn't make Mention it on that video yet because the product wasn't out yet this is what i've been freaking using actually i used it the last time i washed my hair which was three days ago third day hair post gym i went to the gym today got sweaty yeti yeti um and this is still what my hair looks like i don't know what the fuck they put in this but it just adds so much body it adds texture it amps up the waves that you already have and i mean now that I'm at the topic of the guava collection and whatever, these two are still absolute staples every single summer, no matter what. I mean, I love them all year round, but especially in the summer when the sun is out doing its thing, I love using my little rescue spray and the guava leave-in conditioner. Still an absolute favorite, an absolute staple. But all right, that's it, that's it. That was the Ceremonia Kiss Ass compilation. <laughs> Next! Okay, speaking of really good smelling hair products, we're gonna take a minute to talk about hair fragrances, which is something completely new to me because I didn't know they existed. How did I not know? But yeah, let's talk about her. This is the Eva NYC hair fragrance. Oh my god, this shit smells so incredible. And also, look at the bottle. It's just so pretty. It's literally just a perfume for your hair. This one specifically smells like vanilla, musk, and a touch of floral. The perfect summer fragrance in my opinion. If somebody knows the scientific explanation to this, let me know. But I feel like hair retains scent way better than skin does. So when I put this shit all over my hair, I don't even put any perfume on me because that fragrance will linger on my hair all day long and everybody who comes near me will fucking smell it. All right, and the very last hair related product that we're gonna talk about is not a hair product exactly, but a tool. Is this a tool? I don't know, maybe. This is the Floor and Curl Gentle Curl Towel. There's nothing super crazy special or like, I don't know, mind blowing about this. It's literally a giant cotton cloth, but it's pink and it's cute and it's the perfect size. So I usually either use this to wrap my hair while it dries just to plop or I use it as a double wrap. I put my hair in a microfiber towel 
for it to dry, plop, whatever, for as long as I need to. But if I want double the absorption, I wrap this around the towel and it truly like cuts the drying time even more. And it's so gentle on the hair. When I use it like directly on my hair, it's the smoothest freaking cotton ever so like it doesn't like give me any frizz at all it's just very convenient i don't know okay coffee break Next! Okay, let's move on to a couple of skincare things. So if you don't care about skincare or makeup, I guess this is time for you to go. Okay, bye, love you. Like and subscribe, comment, I don't know. Okay, now for the people that care about skincare and makeup, okay. I only have four skincare products that I wanna highlight because they are new in my life. I've been incorporating them more and more as the weather has gotten warmer and I wanna put y'all on, I wanna put y'all on, I'm sorry. I wanna put y'all on to good things other than just hair. This product is necessary all year round. Don't get me fucking wrong. But I know that the girlies be freaking out about this, especially during the summer. So let's talk about sunscreen. Ah! Okay, okay, okay. Oh my God. This is the COTS, the healthier sunscreen, flawless complexion, tinted SPF 50. It's a mineral sunscreen. So I have sensitive skin and she's acne prone. So chemical sunscreens are not the best option for me. I can use a chemical sunscreen maybe once a week or something like that and it's gonna be fine. But as soon as I start using chemical sunscreen consistently, I start getting the most annoying little red bumps like around my cheeks and around my jaw. And I only discovered this when I made the switch to mineral sunscreens, no more bumps, no more fucking bumps. So I'm going back to mineral sunscreens now. I've been searching, I've been trying out things. And as many of you know, mineral sunscreens do leave a fucking cast. Well, I found this one recently at the Allure store. And she's beautiful and perfect and incredible in every single way. As I said, she is a little bit tinted and when you start applying it, it turns a little bit white. But as soon as you rub it for maybe like five to 10 seconds, that whiteness starts disappearing and it starts just blending in with your face and with your skin. And it leaves you the most incredible, beautiful, dewy glow. Obsessed, consider her, that's all. <laughs> Next. All right, so as I said, I am an acne prone baddie. <laughs> So anyways, as an acne prone gal, I require a very special amount of exfoliation in order for my skin to stay as clear as it can possibly be. So recently, this beautiful, wonderful, incredible little exfoliating toner came into my life and I have found balance. This is the Youth to the People Mandelic and Superfood Unity Exfoliant. It has 3% AHA, 2% BHA, and 1% PHA. It's a gentle, solution so it's an exfoliating toner that can be used every day but even though I have sensitive reactive skin I have trained it to be very much used to chemical exfoliation I've been using this shit every day and it has mandelic acid which is one of my favorite types of exfoliants it targets hyperpigmentation dullness dark spots etc and it's something that I deal with because I'm brown so every single thing that I get on my face no matter if I touch it or not i will get a fucking dark spot and a scar you to the people is such a good fucking brand they're incredibly expensive that's, that's their only downside but damn this shit is so good okay next all right so along with having to exfoliate i still need to keep my moisture barrier in check so i've been fucking loving this little serum right here this is the coco kind ceramide barrier serum it treats your moisture barrier to tons of like nourishing ingredients including like hella ceramides and it counteracts the drying effects of exfoliation while well, this is exfoliating exfoliating my skin, getting rid of dead skin cells, improving the dullness of the appearance of my skin. This is providing the nourishment and the ceramides and the moisture and the barrier repairing ingredients that I need to keep it balanced. All right, and for my fourth and final skincare situation, I wanna take a moment to talk about her because she deserves some hype. This is the Tower 28 SOS Intensive Rescue Serum. We love serums. Have I spoken about the SOS spray? Fuck, I can't remember. But if I haven't, I love that thing. That little spray from Tower 28 is incredible for skin that gets red very easily, sensitive skin, skin with eczema, skin with rosacea. That's the only fucking product that I found to aid with my mask knee. And now they came out with 
that but in serum form it has i think the same active ingredients as that little spray yeah it's a more concentrated version of the spray and i use this shit day and night love her okay let's move on to the final category makeup if you don't care about makeup i guess this is where you go okay bye love you thanks for watching okay for those of you who care about makeup let's talk okay first actually this is a product that exists on the line between makeup and skincare. I fucking love this shit so much. This is the Glossier Future Dew. Possibly my favorite thing that Glossier ever came out with is an oil serum hybrid that gives the look of, you know when you put all your like toner and your serums and your moisturizer and your oils and you look like a radiant fucking goddess? That's what this gives, but just in one product and i love using it right before makeup and actually on those like no makeup days that all you want is like and like your skin is all clear and you just want some glisten this is it this is all i put all over my face and i look like a little glazed donut from motherfucking krispy kreme now let's talk about base like what do i use as kind of like a foundation okay i don't wear foundation baby especially during the summer this is the closest I'll get to foundation during the summer. This is the Maybelline Green Edition Super Drop Tinted Oil. This is an exact replica, an exact dupe of the Kosas Tinted Oil. If you didn't like that, you're probably not gonna like this. But if you like that and you wanna pay less, there it is. This gives such a beautiful look to the skin where you can still see your skin through it, but it gives you enough coverage just to even out redness, even out any hyperpigmentation, even out your skin tone while giving you glow and the most lightweight feel. Wonderful, incredible, beautiful, lovely. Okay, next base product that I've also been loving. This has been my favorite fucking concealer ever since I found out about it. This is the Amicole Skin Enhancing Concealer. If you've never heard of Amicole, they're a wonderful small black owned brand and they cater to melanin rich skin tones. So they cater to people from my skin tone and darker. I have their lightest shade, which is medium 2.5 and this is my perfect concealer. I can use it as a full foundation they have a skin tint but this looks way better than the skin tint all over the face wonderful if you are of my skin tone or darker definitely check out amicole their concealer and their skin tint is wonderful but especially all right, next, I have only two more products left. We're almost done, we're almost done. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about how fucking TikTok all of a sudden blew up this product and I ended up buying it and falling in love with it. TikTok blew up the Benefit Benetint. This one is called the Platins, yeah. It is described as a strawberry lemonade shade. And that's exactly what it gives. It's a beautiful little tint. I have it on my cheeks right now. So you can, you can see what it looks like. It's so pretty and this shade gives me like the illusion of a sunburn without the actual sun damage honestly all their shades will give you that effect because it's a tint it doesn't look like a blush it looks like an actual tint so it looks like that that color that flush is coming from within i love it on bare skin i love it on on top of concealer i love it on top of skin tints i love it on top of foundation whatever the fuck you use this will look good on it is benefit making a comeback that's weird, but okay, I'll take it. All right, and the very final product that I wanna mention is a bronzer. This is the Makeup by Mario Soft Sculpt Transforming Skin Enhancer, <clears throat> AKA a fucking cream bronzer. I don't know. <laughs> Marketing really gave it a fucking crazy name. It's just a cream bronzer, Lord. Look at her. She's beauty, she's grace. I love this bronzer so much. I know the color looks very intense on the pan, but look, look, this is what I love about it. I took a bit, right? It's right there. You see how light that is? And I'm not talking about the color, I'm talking about the intensity of it. Like I'm actually able to build it up if I want, but if I just want a very natural bronze, this is what I like, bitch, loved it. He also came out with the powder version. I also got it, I loved it, but I had to give it up for the cream bronzer because, ooh, 
baby. It looks so freaking good. And that's it. I really hope you guys um, found that at least entertaining or like maybe you're interested in some of the products that I use, especially the hair ones. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so very much. Stay safe, stay protected, wear your motherfucking SPF. Protect your hair from sun damage, please. Take care of yourself and others. Go follow me on Instagram at nemesismarie06 and on TikTok at nemesismarie underscore zero six. And most importantly, girls, boys, gender non-binaries. Have a great rest of your day. Happy Pride Month. Bye.